his pitch is going to get right there. It's perfect. And he'll drop the target after the pitcher delivers it. But man, the way a catcher sets up invites it. Some guys do it, obviously, a lot better than most. Here's another 2 2. He wants it down. That's where it is. Moreno takes it. The count is full. And we go down to Tom Verducci. Uh, the Rangers have stolen more strikes, pitches out of the zone called strikes, than any team in baseball the last two years. Bobby Wilson, their catching instructor, instructs his catchers to keep that thumb down to give a target. The old school way, the thumb was up, and that would pull the glove down. Much easier to stick the pitch with the thumb pointing down. Here's the payoff. That was where Heim's value was almost entirely prior to this breakout season offensively. They traded for him from Oakland, and he was a defensive first catcher, graded out well as a framer, big bodied catcher, good arm, and has maintained those abilities as he's added the bat and become an all star. Coming inside, that's where the target is set for this 3 2. And Moreno hits it in the air to left center field. Tavares and Carter on the move. That ball is gone. Gabriel Moreno hits it out. And the Diamondbacks strike first in game two. Now, on the eighth pitch of the at bat, the latest in a postseason full of big swings for him. Well, there's where they wanted it, right? They wanted to go inside and try to lock it up. And by locking it up, they did not get it there. That pitch was probably right down the middle. And when you get it inside, you get it off the barrel of the bat. But when you throw it right down the middle, it turns into a ball you're not going to use again. And the 